Good morning and thanks to the committee for having Encore Vision here to present results from the EVO6 ophthalmic solution phase one, phase two clinical study for the treatment of presbyopia. How about an eye drop to treat presbyopia? The goal of the EVO6 treatment is to restore the microfluidics in the natural lens. It's a bilateral treatment. The goal is also to reduce disulfide bonds that form over the years that compromise cytosol flow in the lens fiber cells from the periphery to the center and back again for near and distance vision. So EVO6 is a choline ester of lipoic acid and it is easily hydrolyzed in the cornea, becoming choline and lipoic acid. There, the lipoic acid diffuses across the aqueous humor, uptaked into the lens, and is reduced to dihydrolipoic acid, a very potent reducing agent that reduces the charge between the disulfide bonds, between the crystalline proteins, and restores the microfluidics of the lens and restores function. We conducted a clinical study with EVO6, a prospective randomized double mass placebo controlled multi center study with 75 subjects randomized two to one. After baseline visits, there were six subsequent visits. Inclusion criteria key to this were subjects between 45 and 55 years of, of age and a distance corrected near visual acuity of worse than 2040 in each eye. We assessed safety during the first week of treatment by dosing just the non-dominant eye BID for one week to look at safety and tolerance. And we also uh, did the study in the US at four sites, safety assessments you can see listed here. We also checked comfort and compliance. And the study itself, demographics, predominantly uh, mean age is 50 predominantly female, predominantly Caucasian. Almost 70% of the subjects were emetropes, and you can see the baseline distance corrected near visual acuities for the study eye and OU in both eyes. EVO6 was safe and well tolerated. You can see the side effects that were recorded during the study. These were uh, generally uh, non uh, non-persistent and, and relatively mild and didn't compromise the study. The efficacy endpoints were to look at the amount of distance corrected near visual acuity restored and, and also to look at the proportion of subjects that gained 10 or more letters in distance corrected near visual acuity. But because this is a bilateral dosing uh, treatment, we focused also on the bilateral effects. And that's what I'll report and show here. EVO6 showed improved bilateral near vision over the course of the study. It was 90 days, BID treatment morning and evening. Results started showing up within a couple of weeks. And as you can see, a consistent improvement over the course of the, the, course of the study when dosing was discontinued at day 90. Snellen measurements are on the right and Logmar on the left. The proportion of individuals that gained 10 or more letters is shown here compared to placebo. Quite a nice response from the natural lens. Here's a little more granularity in terms of the lines of vision regained with the treatment. One line, 84%, two lines, 53%, three or more lines were a third of the subjects. One more interesting view of the data is to see the shift from day one to day 90. And the light blue bars that you see here are day one. And a shift to the left resulted in 82% of the subjects receiving 2040 or better near vision at the, at the conclusion of the study. 2040 vision, of course, is pretty good near vision. We also drilled down to determine what's happening to the lens by using the eye trace aberrometer that can provide a good refractive picture of the lens as treatment progresses, looking at higher order aberrations. And the, the two-dimensional view that you see here is going to show up as a three-dimensional figure in subsequent slides. Red is myopic, green is emetropic, and blue is hyperopic. Here's a subject that was a control, a 
placebo with a three diopter stimulus, look at the panel on the left, which is the near vision results and the uh, refractive power of the lens, no change at day 90. Here's an EVO6 treated subject. Day one, you can see on the panel on the left about a diopter of, of uh, lens refractive power. Day 45, you can see now it's at around two, and day 90 at around three. Here are both eyes for that same subject, demonstrating good bilateral near vision. So in conclusion, EVO6 provides a nice uh, higher order magnitude of refractive power restoration to the lens in the order of, of three diopters, and it's natural bilateral near vision with stereopsis and all the benefits. We're looking at our subjects post-treatment after the 90 days and following them out to seven months. We should conclude that, conclude that study uh, this month and report the results at subsequent meetings. Our next effort, or at least in conclusion, near vision can be recovered. 84% of the presbyopes received 2040 or better near vision, and 53% of them had two lines or more of improvement. There was no change in best corrected distance visual acuity, no change in pupil diameter, no change in IOP. So go going forward, we're gearing up for a phase 2B dose ranging study next year and a pivotal phase 3 in 2018. I want to thank the Encore Vision team, its advisors, and its board for support in this uh, groundbreaking new therapeutic effort. Thank you.